Hello everyone, Timmy Trico coming at you again with another movie review. Today I'm reviewing the film Pawn Shop Chronicles. Now this film was directed by Wayne Kramer and written by Adam Minovich. Now, this film had a limited release in theaters and barely pulled in $8,000. Uh, there was no budget for this film and reviews for this film were mixed to negative. Currently holds a 5.9 on IMDb, a 26% on Metacritic, and Roger Ebert at the Chicago Sun Times website gave it one out of four stars, but it has a 92% liking on Google. Now this film was released in 2013, and it stars Paul Walker, Norman Reedus, Elijah Wood, Matt Dillon, Brandon Frazier, Vincent D'Onofrio, Chi McBride, and DJ Qualls. And this film is a three-part story. Basically a setup like Creepshow and uh, Creepshow 2, where it's three different stories, but they all mesh into one. And it centers around this pawn shop owned by Vincent D'Onofrio and Chi McBride. And the first part of the movie is the first story, starring Paul Walker, West, rest in peace by the way, and uh, they're looking to score drugs. Uh, the second story is uh, Matt Dillon's character who is looking for his uh, long lost wife. Um, and the third story is uh, Brandon Frazier who is an Elvis impersonator. Um, he is looking to make it big in the impersonation business. And, uh, ends up making the deal with the devil pretty much but uh, yeah th this film I really enjoyed this film uh, despite what the critics said um, is it the greatest film I've seen no it's not as good as creep show or anything but I really love the stories in this film I love the characters there were some laughs in this film as well um, especially the first story and the third story but uh, yeah, I enjoyed this film. Uh, the direction, um, the songs, it's just, it's a really good, solid film, in my opinion. Um, I can't believe it's taken me this long to uh, watch this film. I'm trying to watch all the films um, that were made with Paul Walker. Uh, and I'm getting close, but uh, nevertheless, this was a very solid movie. Um, I know a lot of the actors in this film, they all give very good performances. Brandon Fraser's performance as Elvis uh, was okay. Um, and you can definitely tell uh, he's lip singing. He's not singing an Elvis song. There's just no way. But uh, nevertheless, this is a solid film in my opinion. And one I would recommend that you watch if you like these type of movies where they're broken down into multiple stories. Um, I for one enjoy those films and yes so I can recommend that you watch this film. Um, uh, with that being said I'm gonna give the film uh, Pawn Shop Chronicles a 7 out of 10 and give it two thumbs up and like I said I do recommend that you watch it. It is a very solid film. So in the comment section below let me know what your favorite um, Brandon Frazier or Matt Dillon film is. For me, Brandon Frazier, I loved him in uh, George of the Jungle. Um, School Ties is an excellent film. Great ensemble cast, too. Um, Matt Dillon, for me, is probably my bodyguard. Um, I believe it's from 1980. Uh, he's really good in that. The Outsiders is a great film. Um, but the whole cast in general um, did a really good job, and this director, I don't really know too well, but uh, yeah, I enjoyed the film, so definitely check it out if you have the time, and uh, I will see you guys next time in my next movie review. Thank you for watching, and check you later.